What is going on YouTube? Hit it back making another brand new crypto TV episode. In today's video, we are going to be looking at XRP, Ethereum, Bitcoin, as well as the S&P 500. Specifically though, in today's episode, what we need to talk about is the recent movement we've been seeing across the board on pretty much most of the major cryptocurrencies that we review here on the channel. Specifically looking at uh, yesterday's video, you can see if I zoom in, or the past couple of days, we've been tracking kind of these descending flags that have finally broken out. We were going back in forth are we going to be seeing the breakout this week today tomorrow are we going to take you know two weeks longer because we've been tracking the length of the previous two kind of uh descending flags and those have lasted about 60 days and the current one that we're in is only lasting about 25 to 30 days here so we figured oh maybe there's two more weeks of trading well turns out we started to see that breakout just a few days ago here and not only that but we also discovered a new one here so first and foremost just a couple of days ago we were talking about the fact that we're about to burst two to three days ago here then you can see right here in uh two, this is two videos ago because this is 22 hours so in two more hours this will be updated but two days ago then we discovered we just confirmed the breakout like we're about to we've confirmed closure above those resistances and then we found on bitcoin's four hour charts a symmetrical triangle forming which looked to be breaking to the upside here so i'm in shock across the board the way everything's been trading out you can see clear as day here on xrp that we are starting to slide up which is incredible here look you can see we've broken through the downtrend broken through the descending flag here and are starting to pop to the upside so i'm super excited to see that happen here ethereum has broken through its price ceiling here breaking to the upside yet again and then we have bitcoin which broke bullish through its beautiful symmetrical triangle that we slightly tweaked in yesterday's video here and we're also heading to the upside here so crazy things are happening across the board we have to discuss this we haven't seen the breakout just yet within Bitcoin, only hints and signs of it, but I do think it's coming very soon, so keep your eyes peeled on the market. With that all being said, definitely make sure to smash the like button, turn on post notifications, subscribe, and let's dive into today's episode. So guys, as you can see, quick refresh reveals, we are currently trading at 1.22 trillion, up about half a percentage point here, but cryptos are starting to slide to the upside here. Bitcoin's up 1.4, XRP's almost up a percentage here, and a lot of these cryptos, for the most part, are consolidating, but over the past couple of days are actually moving up. Uh, 1.53 in the past seven days, 4.4 for Ethereum, 2.7 for BNB, 4.5 for Cardano, 20% for Litecoin, 15% for Solana. You can see we are starting to form some sort of uptrend here, some lift off here. And I believe this is just the beginning for some of these cryptocurrencies. Now, focusing on XRP, you know, obviously the main focal point of today's video here, like I've said in every video, but for those that are new to the channel here, we've been watching a beautiful descending flag form here for a long time now. Then we saw a beautiful breakout. I was calling it a bull flag. We can call it a descending flag. They're pretty much the same things here, but we confirmed the breakout. We said the opportunity to buy into this would be above its yellow price ceiling. Once confirmed above that, that's when we could take advantage and leverage to the upside here. Well, that not only happened one time, we then saw it happen a second time here. Lower highs, lower lows, found a price floor, headed up on that. You can see we've even drawn the blue band to the upside here. Second, we can confirmed a break above the downtrend here. That was the opportunity to buy in and long it to the upside. Well, guess what? Immediately after doing that, explosion to the upside here. And now we're seeing the same thing. So then we started to consolidate back down again. And we were watching this. The third descending flag here, we're waiting to see. We said, oh, the previous ones lasted 60 days, lasted 50 days. This is only 30 days. Are we going to see the breakout? Are we not going to see the breakout? I'm not entirely sure. Well, guess what? After we've been consolidating downwards here, we kind of started to get a little back and forth, a little wonky, right when we started to see these wicks below. You can see wick, wick, multiple days. And we're getting a little uncertain here, and I made a video talking about the possibilities of us consolidating, filling out the gap here, and then breaking up. But we originally were in the belief that we would break up right here. And that's actually what is now happening, which is pretty funny. What I mean by that is after we started to see the correction back up, we've reversed, retreat, receded back up above the moving averages, above the price floor, and are starting to head to the upside, which is absolutely incredible here. I'm shocked. I'm in disbelief that it happened, but we confirmed this. I basically said at this point, it doesn't matter about when the timing of this breakout is going to be, whether it happens in a week, two weeks, three weeks, or tomorrow. Basically, the easiest point of entry on this is at any point breaking above this yellow band here. And as you guys could clearly see, once confirmed here, you can see 
the consolidation, the clear price, the battle that was happening here, major bear movement, major bull flag, bull movement swinging us to the upside, tons of uncertainty, big decision, no more time left. We had to make a decision and we decided on breaking up. We confirmed above there. We broke above the uptrend, the moving averages, the price floor exploded to the upside here. And more than likely, we are now going to continue this path to the upside here. If we reference the previous runs, you can see we had a little rough start in the beginning on each one. Each breakout had a couple of days where we kind of had a lot of uncertainty, but in the end, we broke up. So I'm expecting the same thing, some uncertainty, then a break up to the upside here. So keep your eyes peeled on this market right now, on XRP specifically. Obviously, we do all of these trades on BidFi, the number one cryptocurrency leveraging exchange that I like to use here on the channel. We had the opportunity two days ago, and honestly, there still is the opportunity to buy in here because as you can see, the past couple of days on the first breakout, you had still a few days to get in if you hadn't already. Same thing with the second breakout here, and here's the third one. So had I have missed out two days ago, yesterday, or even, yeah, today, there is still time today to get in on this because I am still a firm believer we are going to see uh, a, a continued run to the upside. It might just take a wee bit longer than... Um, you know, then just straight moonshot. As you can see, we took about a week before we had the, the run to the upside in the first breakout. And this was about a week two in the first breakout here. So the first and second. So I still expect to see this, which means there's still time to take advantage of this had I have missed out. But obviously I would do so on BidFi, the number one cryptocurrency exchange that I like to use. Not only can you leverage trade, create stop losses, take profits, create, you know, uh, margin trades, leverage trades, everything you can possibly think of. Stop loss, take profit, da, 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 everything. Leverage, market trades, trigger trades, shorts, so on and so forth here. Long and short, all these crypto cryptocurrencies. What's amazing is you can do it to XRP. A lot of you guys ask me over and over and over again, where do you trade crypto? How do you trade XRP? Where do you trade XRP? I don't know any exchanges. I've been using BidFi for over two years with no problems whatsoever here. If I ever had any doubt, I literally clicked message, asked them about a glitch or something, and they've corrected it within, honestly, a couple of hours, if that, maybe an hour, and they've kept me up to date every single time. They did not leave me in the dark, which is incredible uh, support for, and feedback from this exchange here. So make sure to check them out. Link is down in the description below. This is where I trade XRP. This is how you can trade XRP too. The best part is they offer... Well, I mean, there's two best parts, but you can see right here, you can earn up to $2,888 completely free by filling out some of the tasks below here, as well as completing the advanced tasks as new, uh, you have new users and advanced tasks to earn up to 2,888, which is incredible, the amount of bonuses that you can get here. So make sure to check this out. Link is down in the description below. And to top that off, on top of this, how can it get any better? They offer a demo account, which gives you up to two, or, sorry, which gives you $100,000 in Monopoly money to test your skills completely free. I don't know why this is doing that. Let me pull this back up here. Okay, maybe they've updated the chart since the last time I changed this, but I'll have to play around with this um, in a second with you. But the really cool part about, yeah, they definitely just updated their website. Super cool. You got to see it live right here, or maybe this is it. Yeah, the trading view version. I don't know. Now they offer a basic version, much better. This is how I like to view everything. But you can see here, they have a demo account, which gives you up to $100,000 in Monopoly money completely free to test your skills, which means not only can you sign up completely free to the platform, not only can you trade completely risk-free to the platform, you can even earn money up to $5,000, $2,888 completely free by completing the uh, tasks, the new user sign up zone and so forth. So make sure to check it out down in the description below. Moving forward from XRP though, looking at these other cryptos, not only are we in a trade on XRP, we're also in a trade on Ethereum here as we've confirmed completion above our price ceiling, something we did not expect to see happen anytime soon. But because we've confirmed a break above this green resistance price ceiling, this was the opportunity to get in. We bought in at about 1933, trading at 1960. And I'm a strong believer we're going to continue to see a swing to the upside here. Lastly, to wrap up the video with Bitcoin and the S&P 500, Bitcoin beautifully seeing a break to the upside here. You can see we've tweaked the uh, beautiful symmetrical triangle on the four hour charts ever so slightly. But as we fill in this gap here, we confirmed a break above this resistance and I believe are going to continue to explode. But the opportunity to buy in is only above this price ceiling in green here. Once I can confirm a breach above here on the daily, that's when I'll long this to the upside. Until then, I'm still awaiting duck, patiently waiting. But 
I think that's what we're that's what we need to see happen here. We can extend this out too, pretty much. You can see the uptrend forming here. We need to break above this price ceiling for us to be buying in. Once this is confirmed broken, that's when we can take advantage and leverage to the upside here. But until then, let's wait. I'm waiting patiently. As for the S&P, starting to battle that top resistance yet again, I'm just a strong believer that we need to correct before we head up even higher. We are too overbought and we need to dip before we see any runs to the upside. But with that all being said, definitely make sure to smash the like button, turn on post notifications, subscribe, and I'll see you in tomorrow's video. Peace.